guys, this uh, video is just going to be about Bitcoin because there isn't much really to talk about today except Bitcoin. Um, basically, today, a couple of hours ago, we got some really, really bad numbers with non-farm payrolls and, uh, you know, private non-farm payrolls, things like this. Disaster, guys. Um, that is why you're seeing this dump here uh, as of a couple of hours ago. You know, we weren't doing bad. And, uh, and then, boom, we got horrible, horrible numbers. So you can see we actually managed to hang on to this support, 63.1. Uh, and really, guys, that's almost to the dollar. Like You can see that if I zoom in. Um, and so far, we've gotten a bounce. We have retested this still a couple more times. Now, keep in mind, this is the hourly time frame. So it's not a big time frame. Um, now, let me put this on the four hour chart, by the way, so we can see what's happening. Uh, we just started really a new four hour candle um, and it's green, it's barely green, but you can see that the last four hour candle, pretty disastrous. Um, you know, it was making its way up almost to 65.7. And then guys, you know, we get the bad news and we dump. So, you know, but hey, we did hang on to 63.1, thank God. Um, and yeah, I mean, let's take a look at this on the hourly time frame again. Uh, I did see that there was a trend really building. Um, let me take out the trend line here and let's kind of mark this off. Yeah, so this is probably, you know, the best way to draw this trend line. Um, you can see we got rejected here. Uh, we tried to break through it here, but dip back down, tried to break it again. Bad news, back under the trend line. And uh, let's see, guys, I think that's going to be a little bit extra um, resistance when we do come up to that, maybe in the next couple of hours, few hours. Um, so around 63.8 you know, to 64 is going to be a little bit tougher to break. Um, so let's see what happens when it comes to that. Um, let me see what next week holds for us. Um, let's see, today is yeah Friday. So I want to look at this week. I want to look at next week. So next week, guys, uh, there is going to be, yeah, we're going to have ISM, you know, PMI and things on Monday. Uh, on Tuesday, we are going to have, well, it looks like some imports, exports. Uh, that could be a little bit important. Um, we do have on Wednesday, not really much Wednesday. There's really nothing Wednesday. Uh, Thursday next week, yeah, it looks like, you know, jobless claims again. Um, you know, maybe wholesale inventories. Uh, it's not really that important, though. Uh, just jobless claims. And then Friday... Uh, let's see what's going on. Not much, guys. Next week is kind of an empty schedule, so uh, there's not going to be much that really, you know, gets in the way of Bitcoin, really. Um, so, yeah, guys, let's see what goes on with Bitcoin here in the near term. We still have, uh, you know, well, we have a little bit more time before uh, the close on Friday here. And then the weekend starts where it's going to get a little bit boring. I just hope, you know, really we can get through this trend line and this daily resistance here. And start moving towards this uh you know weekly resistance it would be nice if we could break this before sunday and start you know moving up towards the 65.7 resistance once again anyways guys that's all i got for you on bitcoin if you like this video like subscribe activate the bell and i'll see you guys in the next one